My name is Michael Kelleher, and I'll be playing the role of Seymour Crowborn in Niagara University's production of Little Shop of Horrors. This musical is a crazy one. It's about a character named Seymour. He lives in Skid Row, which isn't really a place that anyone wants to live in, and it's kind of a place that you're stuck in for the rest of your life. So he works at Mushnick Skid Row's florist. Basically, I was an orphan. Seymour was an orphan and taken in by Mr. Mushnick, who owns the flower shop. And so he worked there all his life, and that's his job, and he doesn't expect anything else out of life until he's walking by um, just like his daily routine, and he finds this plant out of nowhere and he buys it because it interests him and he's interested in strange plants. And it ends up being this plant that eats a special type of food, a special formula it needs. And it grows and grows and it gives amazing business to the flower shop. Um, and also at that flower shop is a girl named Audrey who works there, who Seymour kind of has a little bit of a crush on. Throughout the play, you'll see that there's a relationship growing between them as well, but what stands in the way really is the plant between the two of them. And so Seymour really has to decide between Audrey 2 uh, or Audrey 1. I actually saw this musical done at a different high school and I was like, one day I want to be Seymour. This is an awesome character and to get this chance so soon in my theater career is really awesome. Oh, it's business like who have asked. Steve has told us like the first rehearsal we had was no one's part is more important than anyone else's in telling this story and I think that's really awesome especially within an intimate cast. What I love about Steve is he'll never give you the answer to the question that he like proposes. He wants you to find out and I think that's really awesome because there's some questions that I'm still like rattling in my brain and I'm like I don't know but we'll try something tonight and see if it works and then he'll give you the feedback on that. He'll also see from a director standpoint that maybe there's something we need to fix or try again but also he'll turn it over to us and say hey Michael like is there anything that you don't feel is working or that we could try differently or if I have a suggestion he's always willing for me to let me try it which I think is really really awesome for us as actors like if we don't feel something or want to try something different that he'll let us do that. Why not come see Little Shop of Horrors? I mean there's everything you could ever ask for in a musical. We have awesome special effects with the puppetry and then there's crazy dance numbers that are supplied by the urchins. Literally every single character in this show is so different that your head's just gonna keep turning you don't know what to expect and I think that's why you should come see Little Shop of Horrors is because you're not gonna know what to expect from this show. You might come in and think that it's gonna be an awesome time and you might leave and you might say, whoa, what was that? It'll get you thinking.